They found Tom Brady's stolen jersey in Mexico, and authorities say they believe the guy who did it is a dude named Mauricio Ortega, who is a journalist for a Mexican media outlet called La Prensa, uh, or at least who was until he resigned last week in shame because uh, he was the target of this investigation. And now TMZ Sports has photos of this guy up close and personal with Tom Brady more than 10 years ago. He's yeah. been, he has had access to the Super Bowl locker room since at least 2005. Here he is with Tom Brady after Super Bowl 39. Uh, you can see him right there. After he uh, hung out with Tom Brady, he went over to Robert Kraft and took a selfie with Robert Kraft. The following year, he got face-to-face -face with Heath Miller, the tight end for the Pittsburgh Steelers, and took a selfie with him. And then he went and hung out with Ben Roethlisberger. A couple years later, here he is with Brandon Jacobs of the New York Giants at Super Bowl 42. The point of this is, this guy who was suspected of stealing not only one of Tom Brady's jerseys, but two of Tom Brady's jerseys, one from Super Bowl 51, another one from 49, and then possibly Von Miller's helmet from Super Bowl 50, has been infiltrating, or at least been in the locker room for years. Yeah. Who knows yeah. what kind of stuff this guy but, may have took. But to me, this makes it all the more easier to understand how he got his hands on this stuff. It, it's not a weird situation if you see this guy and you know that he's been in the locker room. Right. Not gonna, it's, not, it's not gonna make you look. If he's in and around your stuff, you're not gonna yeah, think, what is he doing? And, and he's a journalist. Maybe at first he was doing his job, and then it's kind of a crime of opportunity. You see that these valuable items are just laying around, and maybe one day he gets the idea to take something. If you like what you just saw, videos, great stories, and crazy photos, we've got more like it every single night on TMZ Sports on FS1.